must be too scared to watch an episode of HGV today. Well, you know, maybe they're too distracted having school on the, you know, 31st of October. Can you believe that they make us come to school? Oh well, since they do, we can get back at them by eating way too much sugar and crash hard tomorrow during first period. Whoa, that's crazy talk. Let's have fun tonight, but let's be ready to learn tomorrow. You're right. We need to finish the quarter strong, Abigail. But before we do, let's start this episode strong with the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. It's great to show our appreciation for our great nation. One way that I'd like to demonstrate my patriotism is to give back to my community. How can we do that? We're only in middle school. Lots of ways, Abigail. One way is contributing to our canned food drive. That sounds great. How can I learn more? Oh, hey, David. Funny seeing you here around here. I know you're at student council. Is there any sort of uh, fun, exciting events coming up in the next few weeks? Actually, there is, and uh, it's the Camp Food Drive. It's going to go on from November 14th to the 18th, and uh, it's actually a competition between the grades. Is there any sort of a uh, prize or uh, reward for winning? Um, yeah. The grade that gets the most cans uh, will get 35 minutes of free time, um, which you can do. You can go inside, you can go to the gym, you can use your phone even. Yeah. Is that during class? Yeah, during class. Wow, that's even more exciting. What type of goal are we having for this canned food drive? Um, we're going to have 75 minute cans as our goal. I know it's a tough one. It's about seven cans per student. But I think we can reach it. I think we can reach it too. Nice seeing you here, David. Nice seeing you too. Thank you. Thank you. Are you looking for a sport this winter? I'm always looking for great activities. Then you should consider the Clackamas Wrestling Club. It's open to boys and girls that want to join in with this great sport. You could even compete against other middle schools representing HBMS when the competitive season starts in January, right? Indeed. It's a great way to stay in shape and possibly try something new. Pick up a flyer in the main office. Are there other winter sports available to the Herons? Wow, wrestling is the only competitive sport offered this winter. Herons can recreationally ski with our snow riders. What are the snow riders? The snow riders are 7th and 8th graders that want to ski or snowboard for six Saturdays starting in January with Mr. Lippert. They go to Mount Hood Meadows. Hey there, Herons. It's uh, Mr. Lippert here, and we go up to Mount Hood for six Saturdays in January and February. If you want to go up, see me for details, or go online to the school's website and sign up. Hope to see you up there, Harris. But I'm a sixth grader. Can I still go skiing? Sure, but sixth graders will be going on Sunday starting in February with Mr. Oliver. But I've never gone skiing before. Um, this program is for beginners, thorough experts, and lessons are included for most of the participants. Where can I get more information? Come see Mr. Oliver and Mr. Lippert at conferences this week to get all the details. Well, the responses to Nebo's knowledge have been overwhelming. We had so many correct responses. Let's check in with Mr. Nebo now. Oh my goodness! What are you people doing? I'm trying to read my favorite book, The Dictionary. Well, we just wanted to tell you that we know what the only mammal that can fly is a bat. Knowledge. You guys are correct. The last week's answer was a bat. Are you guys ready for the second week's trivia question? Uh, yeah. Because it's the second week, it's going to be a two-parter. And it's the last here on TV before the big presidential election. So this is going to be a presidential question, okay? First, what is the minimum age to become president? And who was the youngest president to ever be elected? If you think you know the answer to those questions, email herontelevision at gmail.com by the end of today 
and we will respond to you with different music genres or artists that you get to pick from and you'll be able to hear on the Bell Music. Thank you guys all for responding last week. We had a lot of kids send in the correct answer and be listening over the next few weeks to hear your music on the Passing Time Music. Sound good? Thanks, Sister Neba. We'll be sure to email you soon, if we know it. Thanks, Aaron. Thanks, Mr. Nebo. We'll be waiting for those email responses to pour in today. You must send the correct responses to heronTelevision at gmail.com today to be able to select the Passing Time playlist. Good luck, Aarons. Time is flying by this episode. I think we better get to the joke of the day. <laughs> hey, do you want to hear a joke? Of course I want to hear a joke. What is the best drink to have on Halloween? I don't know. What is the best drink to have on Halloween? A smoothie with whipped scream. <laughs> oh my god, that's, that's really funny. Hey guys, have you heard about the anime club? This is an anime club? Yeah. Where does it mean? It means in Miss Foster's room in 205. When does it mean? On November 1st and it's every other Tuesday. Cool. I guess we'll see you there. Come, Come to the anime, anime club. club! Every other Tuesday. Tuesday. But what will the weather be like for tonight when we don costumes and beg for candy? Huh? Let's just look at the weather. We may so we may stay dry tonight after all. Fingers crossed. Do you know what else my fingers are crossed for? The sequel to Goonies to finally be made? Never! Why would you ever want to taint such a masterpiece? I'm crossing my fingers that I'll finally win the hair and call it Ryan. Hey, how you doing? Good, how are you? Good. You know what I want to know? What day National Pancake Day is? I want to know who's been safe, respectful, and responsible this week. You got it close. Let's do the hair and call out during. and see Miss Damon to claim your prize. Well, it's all we have for this week. Be sure to follow us on Facebook, Subscribe. YouTube, Twitter, and Instagram. Find us online to stay in touch with all the things HVMS. Well, I'm Abigail. And I'm Brooke. Have a spooktacular evening, and... Began to rise when suddenly 